Unfortunately, the sign here has sustained a little bit of damage. Hopefully, it can be repaired. So, we're up here. The window there, on the window, it says Benlet Bowling Alley, so maybe that's actually the name for it. I didn't actually mention that last time. Either way, let's go in and uh, play some machines. So, looks like there's actually some customers in, which is good to see. It's definitely looking more empty. Piccolo has some more prizes here now. So, um, yeah, let's go. Call me an absolute spang because I didn't actually mention this last time because I was in a bit of a rush, but this door at the very back, you can see the back of the bowlingo here, which is absolutely incredible. Um, I wonder if putting my phone light to it will give you a better view. If not, I'll take a decent picture on my phone and um, I'll put it over this video if it doesn't actually work. But yeah, I was in a bit of a rush last time. I do actually have uh, more time on my hands today. So um, yeah, anyway, you can see it better now. That is the back of a um, Bowlingo, which I've never seen in person before, but I can now, sort of. And uh, I'm telling you guys about it, or showing you rather, on this video. So um, that's that. I'm gonna get some change and I'm gonna play some machines. Um, I don't know about on camera, but I'm gonna play the pushers today. So um, just context really. Um, Last time I was here, me, my dad and my uncle went on the speedboat ride and uh, we didn't have much time before we needed to set off home. So it was a flying visit last time. This time me, my nan, my dad and my granddad have uh, come on the speedboat ride with me. And um, we've come back here and I do have more time on my hands. So um, yeah, I'll get to play in here a bit more, which is good because this isn't one that's going to be featured on Claw Track all the time, unfortunately. So um, that's that, either way, um, let's uh, play some claw machines. Right, so I think I'll start off with Piccolo. Not sure if we'll win again, because I think it was by fluke last time, but either way I'll play it because it is a very rare machine. There was someone who commented on my short I made of this place last time. You said they are the Piccolo and they're based in Germany, so that's two of them we know about. There might be more, but I'm not sure. Again, it's, we don't know because it's a very, very rare allowed machine. Ooh. Seems to be rigging properly this time. Dear, worst case scenario, we can always play that. This is the X1. It was broken last time and it's still broken this time. Um, yeah. Um, okay, we're down one EX1. I can even get my pound back out. Might have just lost a quid. John down there it says there are no two peas, but they bought a dollar some morons, but they've got a 2p in it anyway. Um, so it's just this one. It's um, unfortunately weak. Mr. Claw and uh, Piccolo are the best claws in here anyway. Um, and then obviously there's bowling, which we will play again. Uh, I don't know about pushes, I might film a bit, but maybe not loads because it is claw track. Um, unfortunately, like, I like the circuit and I appreciate it because it's obscure, obscure and they've got rare machines, but you know, I'm not going to lie and say the maintenance is top tier because it's not, but... It's, a, it's at the end of the day, it's just an arcade connected to a chippy over there. And uh, not sure exactly how much money they make because there was a few customers just in now, but they've left. This is, so it's literally just me in here now. So, oh, never mind, somebody else. So, 
think that's that really. It's um, it's definitely not a busy arcade, but for what it is, like I said last time, it is good. I like it. That might hit the shoot. Yeah, of course it does. Last play on this. Oh, actually, never mind. The one after this will be the last one. play it again we might get a win later oh, yeah. unfortunately the um com the um I lost four words the um variety of claws we've been playing in this video aren't very high so it's gonna be Mr. Claw and Piccolo now uh, I've given you a tour of this place already and uh, as you can see um, it's not a very big arcade but for what it is it is good I'd rather one arcade here than none so Imagine the payout rate would be too high on this, or too low, sorry. Someone's playing bowling, though, so uh, I'll probably keep playing this until they're done. In fact, after this clip, I might. Take it back around there and see if we can see the pin setters in action or balls. That's, that'd be some uh, interesting footage to get that not a lot of people could. That being unless they come to this arcade. Sorry about the glare from the light, but. It's the only way you're going to see this really. Um, yeah, that is a um, bowling out in action. Incredible. I can't believe I'm seeing this. I can't see the ball lift, however. I'll try and show you that now, actually. Or at least part of it. There we go. Blue. And that's all we can see, really. But hey, um, again, I appreciate seeing this because you don't see this every day or in every arcade because most of them are blocked off. But here, there's a little window so you can see it. Ooh, let's go. Obviously, if I win on this, the rest will just be a uh, Mr. Claw. So, um, payout-wise, so the maximum amount of wins I can get in this episode are two. So, obviously, once they're paid out, uh, there's not really much point in playing them again. Uh, I will feature bowling, so this will probably be another short episode. As pretty much confirmed, lane one has sounds. Oh. Gonna get copyright strikes for the music there. But uh, we got a win. All right, there we go. Got it out. Another, another one of the minions. And that was payout, I believe. Once again, Bowlingo. Um, last time we discovered that one has one pin. It won't register this one has the ball because I heard one of the um, spare messages. So uh, let's do this once again. 
as it rejected one of them. And there's this one's three pound ago now. What the hell? I may have lost money here. Right, um, one go for the price of two, that was. Four quid. Best be worth it. Um, I'm actually going to make a steady place to put the camera so you can see what's going on. There. That should work. Seven there, pretty decent. So um, yeah, this side obviously works better than lane two, but yeah, very good. Do love a good ball, Lingo. Oh yeah. Sledgehammer and the uh, gameplay music playing at the same time. Oh, I'm gonna stop it now. 
I'm obviously not going to purposely get people on camera, but I'm very happy to see that this arcade has got customers. That gives me some hope. Because I saw a review from 2017 when they said that the guy who wrote the review was the only one in there at the time. And I was the only one in here last time too. So, then again, it is summer season now. But again, I'm happy that people are in here and obviously spending money. So, it gives me hope that this arcade will be around for a little bit longer. Also, I put my video up, my last video, and obviously this one will go up too. So um, obviously more people will know about it, so hopefully some enthusiasts from our community will visit this arcade. And, to make it even better, it's easier to find now, because I put it on Google Maps. In fact that, so um, obviously my dad struggled to find it last time, but I made it a bit easier for him this time, because you just type Ben Lech Arcade into Google Maps. Obviously, I put it there under that name, so... Nope. Just play this until I get a payout. So, um... That. If I get one beforehand, I might play Bowlingo again. I do quite like it. Though, to be fair, I might anyway. I'm a claw guy, yeah. Um, but... There's no, I don't hate Elo, but they're not my favourite, so I'd say Bollinger is my favourite machine in here. Simply because there's none anywhere else in this part of the country that work properly. I'm looking at you, Black Cat, and Fun Factory, Fun Factory 2. Ooh. This one obviously is set strong, so if it is ready to pay out and I've got a good enough grab, it will win. So, not sure about the EX ones in here, however. Um, Piccolo is quite good as well, because both times I've come in, I've had a win off it, so I'm happy with that, to be honest. You might have noticed Red Hot Jazz is mute now because that was the thing you could hear all over the arcade last time. Um, this might be a shameless plug, but whoever owns this arcade, which I'm gonna assume, well not assume, because I know it's your Jolly Fryer that own it, um, so if the owner of Jolly Fryer, Fryer slash Ben Leck Arcade is watching this video, um, hire me. I'll fix your machines for you. I travel all the way from where I live in North Wales, which is like close to Rill and stuff, just to do it. Here and cash roulette going off. Oh, it's um, grab it. Well, it did grab it just to let go as it's supposed to do. I imagine the payout will be quite low on these considering it's me to you, both, which I'm not sure if they're still worth a fortune. Because they were like back in the early 2010s, um, not sure if they're still at the same value today in 2023. Right, final panels. Quiet. 
to end this video off, actually, I'm going to play Bowlingo again, so... Well, I'll play the pushes first, I think, maybe. Will I? Uh... Yeah, um, Bowlingo first, and I'll do the pushes off camera, I think, unless I want to film those. Last claw go. Not the bestest of grabs. No, well, we got one win anyway. Right, let's finish this off with a bit of bowling. Let's play this once again. Hopefully, it actually um, gives me a go for the proper price this time, though. Thank you. It's the end of the life for this um, top here because um, I'm going to put it down here to film this and I'm going to bin it. I've got some more at home anyway, so it's the end of the world. Right, uh, let's finish off this episode unless I decide to place some pushes to finish it off. I decide to film them, it won't be loaded, so. Trying to steal my uh, bowling balls, are you? Give us a go. Right, you can have this uh, one go. So, uh, Daredevil Grandad, as we'll call him. as well as last time but that's that still not the worst it 
it's uh, unorthodox, but I am going to play the pushes on video now for the claw track. Um, just to finish off, pretty much, I'm trying to probably just be one round on each one. So I'm going to start for this epic uh, cash roulette. It's uh, very bright, as you can see. Just found the sign on the um, thing there. No smoking. I probably can't see much, but because I've shown how to it being dark, what I can do in editing is uh, try to brighten it. I don't know how well that's going to go, but. much of it, I don't think. Got some back. The wheels, I don't think, work anymore. That pusher bed's completely out. The only lights on it, it's just a little bit there. Um, and then these two change, all well, these three change ones, probably on the same side. So. For this one. Here's Rio Carnival, unfortunately two motors are out, so it's just this side. So I've already given the novelty of the darkness bit for the video, and it's going to be a pain to edit during um, editing. But instead play this side, which seems taped up, so has it been thought parked at some point in its life? Also says 10p, I go there, that's a lie. It's actually 2p, and we get two steps with it. This one's jammed, but... Again, how often do you see a Rio Carnival these days? If these clips are short, then it's just because I'm showing off these, I'll play more off camera, of course. It's claw track, not coin pusher track, so um, that's why I don't show them off too much here. I've already done videos on all these pushes in here for other locations. Got some there anyway. Um, because he wants to do everything, Ben One has told me to play the Red Hot Jazz, which is this one here. So I'll do that now. The yeah, push of bed is very slow and it's very dark as well. Is it jams? Yeah. Few of them back. Just get me chips from up there. And I'll finish off just with a quick play on this uh, flipper with it here. Just the brightest one in here, I'd say, because the playfield lights work, but just not the top one, which is probably not the only one like that. This side's jammed. I think. Actually, I think all of them are jammed, apart from this one. I think we'll call it there. That's my second Ben Lack Arcade video. Hope you've enjoyed it. Decided to come and give it more of an explore here. Um, yeah, um, that's that. I might come back again at some point, but it might not be soon because I don't live dead close to it, but that's, that's that. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you all next time. Take care and goodbye.